Yo, Steve Romanuk here in Utah, Deer Valley, getting some lift access on my Mongoose Booter. Just here to tell you a little bit about the spec and uh, the features for 2010. So some of the key features of this 2010 Mongoose Booter, it's a totally stock bike, we don't update them at all, we ride them just as you would buy them on the showroom floor. One of the coolest things about this bike is that it's a bike that's been to the World Cup podium, but also been in some of the biggest free ride movies. We use a 1.5 inch head tube, allows us to make a stronger front end, stiffer. Um, you can run a zero stack headset, which gives you more options for uh, you know a lower, lower front end. The materials we put into this frame is 6061 aluminum. We use a monocoque top tube. You know, we've kept the rear end really stiff and easy. It's really simple. There's no real adjustments. I'm running the 2010 Boxer up front. It's working really nice. We got just a little over eight inches of travel in the back. RockShox's vivid rear shock. Free drive suspension is unbelievable. I mean, the big key with the suspension design is it's always keeping you moving forward. The free drive is a Mongoose specific pattern been working out really well. We utilize it through the whole Mongoose lineup. Uh, works with an isolated BB which gives you minimal chain growth. I mean your cranks stay flat and level right through as you're going through all the travel. It keeps that rear end nice and stiff on you. The 150 mil Maxo works great. Changing flats is nice and easy. And you know it, its big key feature is just getting through the rough stuff. You know it's not a vertical axle path. It's more of a you know a half moon that's going to kind of on those square edge hits, it's going to get up and over it and wants to keep you going, you know. I'm 200 pounds, I ride it all year and I have no issues, so we really hope if it's going to work for a guy like me, it's going to work for any consumer out there on the market. Thanks for checking out my 2010 Booter. Highly recommend you get a chance to go ride one of these things, and uh, we're going to go check out Deer Valley.